Hey guys, it's Jarhi and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. In uh, in the last uh, episode, we uh, found out Ursta is uh, unfortunately died. And uh, I guess Aaron wants his uh, friend. So uh, we're going to report to the king and uh, see how what he thinks. I've sent a messenger to the claim to let everyone know. If there's anything you or your clan need for her arrangements, you need but ask. There'll be time for all of that later. I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about Ursa. To learn she lives, then lose that hope, seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun. Tell him what you found in his papers. A letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. The name was Ayland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. It's by the edge of the Mesa, near the temple. Used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Erend, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. <clears throat> Aloy, a moment, please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? I don't think this really is the time, but... She's not the one who's suffering now. You are. She died before you could say goodbye. Is it that obvious? You're right. I'm dwelling on my pain. Not just hers. And there's only one thing left that can help. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. Or maybe I'll just kill him, you know? Uh, can I... Wait. Let's fast travel this way, it's uh, faster. Too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. Blaze. It must be leaking from something upstairs. All right, let's go upstairs. More blade. That's a lot of blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off, it'll be just what Durval promised. 
smoke will darken the sun as the city goes up in flames. There's, there's got to be a way to stop it. It looks like a wooden bracket. Not very strong. Help me push this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is gonna get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Uh. You just drop a bigger bomb in the lower section of the city? Is that a good idea? We did it! Durval's best shot, and Meridian's still standing. This is over. Durval said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. And that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. He tries for the palace. He's finished. Okay, investigate area. Boot tracks with just a bit of blaze in them. Bring water. Can I interest you in a reasonable charge? Get to the fire and set up a bucket line. What happened? I haven't heard a blast like that Can since the liberation. Blast? Could you spare a moment to speak of the finer things? There's smoke rising from the edge of the mesa. The tracks laid inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. Uh, okay, that should be a yeah, maybe downstairs. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. <laughs> Durval did find a way into the palace. So that is uh, Ishra, the uh, bomb. There to see the sun god on his knees. of my right to kill your father, so I'll have to settle for you. I'm going to enjoy watching the Karja burn, even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian Avad. Breathe in the stench and choke on the ashes. Something's wrong. It didn't... I, I didn't hear anything! There's a bit of smoke rising from the mesa's edge. No! It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner! 
What's this? Oh. You must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp. And disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First yours, then Avad's. Oh, a uh, shotgun. Linhalt, maybe? Bad day for one of us. Ah! Those majestic, murderous glint hawks! Do only that I hope anti... you're not fighting these things because there's more in the way. Yeah, more. Uh, let's uh, actually switch to the cross outfit that we uh, took last time. Oh, well, still got one more. will do nicely. Alright, switch it back. As much as I wish Ursa was here to kill you, I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Aaron, you'll screw it up! I know what you are afraid of. Going back to mainspring in chains. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now.
Aloy, to say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You saved Meridian. And because of you, there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. And I don't want to try. I hope you will consider staying in Meridian. Mm, not so cool. It's time for me to go. Uh, w wait a moment. As I said, I'd hoped you'd consider staying in Meridian. And why is that? Well, I would think that would be obvious. Not to me. Huh. Well, to start with, you kept the city from going up in flames. You were strong, shrewd, and, and capable. I, I could use someone like you at my side. Uh... It might be worth taking a moment to examine what you just said. You just lost Ursa, a woman who stood at your side and could easily be described as strong, shrewd, and capable. It's pretty clear how you felt about her. And now you're asking me to take her place. Is this a job offer or a proposition? By the sun, you do indeed share much with Ursa. Including a withering eye for foolishness. Ah, please, accept my apologies. Seems I'm getting ahead of myself. I need some time to resolve my feelings. I will be forever grateful to you, Aloy. And in time, I'd like to get to know you better. Shall we leave it at that, then? Uh, yes. It's time for me to go. Of course. I hope you find what you're after, Aloy. And if need be, I will come to your aid. As sure as the sun's rising. Uh, let's talk to Devon and uh, see what he has to say. Is this? How? Hmm. How do I get to the other side? thought I have uh can get more dialogue out of that. Aloy, I was just thinking about Ursa. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place, to put him down. But she also told me to grow up. I gotta admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do. Right? <laughs> you're asking me? I'm pretty sure you're older. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? You did with Durval. 
Uh, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. So, Ow. after all this, what's next for errand vanguardsmen? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get in touch with my clan and we'll lay Ursa to rest properly. Like how she would have wanted. And by that I mean less chit chat, more drinking. What do you think the Osirim will do to Durval? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. I can live with that. In fact, I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. Well... I know. You gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master. All before breakfast. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. And now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. I'll always have a minute for you. Maybe even two. Two? Huh. Well, she likes me. Okay, so I guess uh, that's one of the main mission ended. Okay. Now we uh yeah we need to go find our mother way up here. Got a okay. We got a rope caster. Oh, I'll put those to use. I'm not sure I will use that. I just uh, have a Why better version. We go to the other one. Because I want you to succeed. Good hunting. We'll talk later. Wait. Damn you. Okay. Corrupt the machine. Corrupted watchers. Eclipse. Just like you said. Delvers made off with any witch's heart, but not the ancients buried in the ground. Still sniffing around. Got us a corpse over here. Need to get rid of this watch.
we can get up there. And then there one of them. Something over here. There you go. Uh Yes, we will enter this way. Well, it's uh, this way to get in. And uh, I'm getting. Oh, it's uh, maybe this. That's a. Uh... Oh. Corrupt. That's a uh, problem. How can I sneak past Corruptor? I, I don't want to kill all of these just to uh, get inside. I think I can lure the corrupt. Might prove a challenge. Lure the uh, corrupt uh, elsewhere. But I need, I need him to get away a little bit. Use the uh, rope caster to tie it, maybe. Yeah. 
has to be that. one of the Deathbringers Olin talked about. Fitting name. I'll never get into that tower. Unless I destroy that thing first. Yeah, but uh, I guess... Uh... <laughs> Uh, this might make the uh, the episode an hour long, but I think we can do it. Just uh, need a lot of time. Uh, can I get like up there? I eh, probably not, so I need to go the other way. Is that uh, the machine's left? Let's see how we can uh, do this. Okay, do I have? There you go. So the body weakness is fire and shock. The repeater cannon that is. Component. Not sure where it is. Cooling rot. Deep side. Uh, it's exposed when the machine overheats. Destroying this component causes high damage and the machine to overheat fast. Okay, so uh, we need to destroy that uh, as fast as possible. Core. Exposed when machine overheats. Okay, so we need to focus the uh, cooling rods and then the core flame floor grenade launcher somewhere in there we got fence this exposed when the machine overheats drawing this can cause high damage and overheat faster Easy. okay we got gun turn unit is important for damage machine can be picked up and use it after it Okay. So we can uh take off the uh the gun turret and then just blast it again. Is they is this able to swarm launchers? Stabilize healing this can work clear damage to the machine and cause machine to fall on its side. Okay. Every cannon turn somewhere in there. Drop 
prone to overheating. That's the uh, repeated pattern. Oh, that means I should probably heat that, heat that right now when it's uh, overheating. I think I'm spotted. <laughs> Hitting that thing really hurt it. Oh, come on, no! It just weighs... ...thing. Oh! Wow, okay. That... Wait, what? That's way easier than I expected. Did you see that? No answer, huh? Figures. Things just keep getting stranger. I need to find a way inside the tower. Looks tight, but I can squeeze through. Yeah, but uh, I I think we'll leave these uh to the next episode. Um, hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I will see you in the next one.